played against both coordinators and the head coach has been in Buffalo. The defensive coordinator has been in uh, Baltimore. So try to learn the personnel the best that we can. Try to anticipate what we may see from from them in all three phases. You know, most of the scheme stuff would probably come from you know, somebody other than the Giants. So you're watching the Giants for, for personnel to see guys' skill set, how they play. Um, you know, and then you're just trying to Try to get them prepared the best that you can for the things that you think you might see. Do you see this? You know, good to see him back out there. He did some good things, and you know we'll get get moving forward with them. What's, what's the process <clears throat> like been for you? I guess Mike over the last 24 hours, maybe well, communication with players, guys coming, guys going, and how how was that? Really? Well, I mean, we we know it's a difficult time. Haven't been through it, you know, um, as a player and a coach. It's um, it's not easy. We try to communicate. Is it with each guy, each person? Uh, they put a lot into it. Some of them have spent a lot of time with us. Um, you know, and we also try to communicate with the ones that, that we do want back, that we have all intentions of continuing to work with them. Um, we know how important the practice squad is, how critical it is to, you know, to our season, not only to, to us and the games that we would have to, put, you know, use those guys in, we have done that a lot, is also their development. Like with the 